is breaking news. It is 6.30. We want to get back to a big story we're following of a deadly crash in Gresham this morning. Let's get right out to Fox 12's Drew Reeves, who's at the scene for us. Drew, good morning. Good morning, yeah. Uh, we still don't have a whole lot of information about what led up to this crash, but you can uh, see the car is still here, flipped over. It looks like in someone's yard. It looks like maybe that car took out uh, some fencing, and you can see a sign on the ground as well that that car had hit. It's even difficult to tell what kind of car this is. You can see it's pretty uh, damaged out here, and as you mentioned, one person we know is dead. As far as we can tell and what we can see, this is the only vehicle involved in this crash out here. It's on West Powell Boulevard out here in Gresham. Uh, West Powell is closed between Wilson and Florence. We've got some video of this crash as well, giving you a little bit closer look of the car out here. Uh, but I did speak to some neighbors. They didn't want to go on camera, but they came out and were kind of watching what happened. And they told me that that they had heard the crash happen right around four o'clock in the morning. They said they heard some loud bangs, didn't know exactly what it was, but then saw the police vehicles coming up and knew it was a crash. They said they did not know that it was a deadly crash, though, until they had seen that on the news. One of those neighbors told me that West Powell out here in the middle of the night, uh, he said he regularly hears people speeding very quickly uh, and driving erratically on this road. So he said that he was not too surprised to hear uh, what had happened out here this morning. Uh, but again, we do know that one person is dead. This is on West Powell Boulevard between Wilson and Florence. This is closed, has been closed uh, since that crash happened right around 4 o'clock this morning. And we imagine we'll be closed out here for a little bit longer. Police are flying a drone right now as they continue their investigation. But as we learn more, we'll bring that to you throughout the morning. But for now, reporting live in Gresham, Drew Reeves, Good Day, Oregon. And we're going to toss it over to Tony with traffic. Yeah, Drew, all I would add to that is that that location is just a little bit to the west of Eastman Parkway, which is unaffected uh, by that closure you mentioned. That's just a one block section of West Powell that is shut down from northwest Wilson to southwest Florence. Uh, freeway